Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. So today, tonight, I should say, is going to be a belated uh, friend mail share. Um, my friend P, um, who's over on Whimsical Endeavors, love you girl. Um, she sent this to me a while back, but I just had a lot going on and um, so I'm playing catch up. I have some more friend mail that I will be sharing that is belated. Um, it was just... Again, a lot was going on and they kind of got set to the side for a while. And so now I'm playing catch up. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, if you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button. Ding the bell next door if you want to get notifications of future videos. Thumbs up, likes are always appreciated. And any questions or comments, please leave them down below. So let's take a peek. If you hear like noise in the background. Karma's in here. I've been in the craft room trying to go through stuff. Trying to work on the craft room. It's a very slow and painful process. And um, yeah, it's painful. But she's like being nosy in the throwaway pile. And of course she likes to mess with the bags. So that's what that is if you hear it. And this is the super cute um, tote bag that he sent. Um, it's too big, so I may or may not be able to share it with you. Let's see. We're going to start with the paper. She sent a lot of paper. So, if you're new... I love to travel and uh, cruise, and so I'm always collecting um, papers that are related to travel and cruising or anything like that. And she, P, sent me a ton of it, and I am so excited that she did. I absolutely love it all. And um, let's start get started. So. This one is from KS Craft, and it looks like the collection is called the Wanderlust Collection. And some of these she sent two of, so I'm showing you the front and the back at the same time. Uh, I have been to some of these places, not all. Um, Hawaii, California, Germany, Mexico, Munich, uh, Europe... Chicago, Portland, uh, Berlin. Anyway, so there's that. Then this one, these are separate, but love postage stamps. So does P. And so I was really happy that she shared that one with me. Um, here's the back. So we have the globe. And then we have this really awesome cut apart. This is going to be fun to use because I don't have anything like this to use in my albums. Oh, looks like, yeah, she gave me two of those. Uh, let's see. All right, then we have some clouds. Not sure what those are, but they are pretty. And what I love most about this, one... It has got the hot air balloons in it and a dirigible. But it's so hard to find. Granted, these aren't cruise ships, but they're boats. It is so hard to find scrapbook paper with boats or ships or cruise ships in them. So, super, super love this one. And then there's the back. This one's called uh, Up and Away. Super pretty this okay so the collection's called what's up and then the names of the pages so this one's called first flight so we got the hot air balloons there's the back love this um i don't normally like pages that are like a solid sheet that you should use all together but this one I love and it's going to be hard for me to figure out how to use it without covering up everything and then there's the back 
And then we have different passport stamps. And then the planes just falling all willy-nilly. Here's some Cartabella. And this has a really great texture to it. And these stamps are stunning. And then there's this one. I love the compass. And some beautiful cut. Now this is going to be a hard one to use. I might have to hunt some more of that one down. Because uh, I love both sides. And then there's that one. Love, love, love. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to hunt this collection down. Because this is gorgeous. Some more hot air balloons. Little one cent prepaid postage circa 1900. This is called, this is from a line called Fab Scraps. Love the colors. And this is beautiful. So, this is like an underwater scene. So, you have like the little sea anemones and all that stuff. Absolutely beautiful. And then there's this one that one and all of these kind of look like they're print they're supposed to look like they're printed on like a canvas or something but uh another beautiful collection that one love love i adore lighthouses i used to collect them i stopped um but i still love lighthouses Pretty, pretty, pretty. Yeah, this is another hard one to want to have to cut up too because I love both sides. And there's that. I think that Ashley would probably fall in love with this collection. She's um, a huge nautical freak like me. And then we have some pretty um, texture paper from Basil. I like this crackle effect on there. Like that. We have some polka dots and some zigzags. There's another one of those. Now this is gorgeous. I love all this weathered wood. And then learn from yesterday, live for today, hope for tomorrow. Awesome. And I actually have this album. I love this album. There's that. And that. And beautiful. She totally hooked me up with some pattern paper. Some gingham. And then uh, different instrument boards. Don't like that one. It's almost on empty. That's, to, that's not good. Then we have some wheels and uh, chains and little bucks. And polka dot. So she kind of sent stuff like uh, groupings of collections. So, and I love them all. This is a really soft, like, blue green that's on this um, craft color. Love the distress look. Some polka dots. I think this one's a repeat. Yep, that's a repeat. There's two of these. So there's that side and that side. Some awesome uh, sticker sheets. So could definitely use that. This is authentic. Um from it says superior paper the collection is called durable we've already seen that one I love that I love old newspapers or advertising so this one's a great one there's the back I can't wait to see this side that is awesome and this collection durable oh my gosh I'm in love with love it love it this is from Kaiser Craft, and this is the Antique Bar Bazaar Collection. I'm sorry. Some pretty cut-aparts. And, oh, gosh, love that, too. 
And then we have some more sticker sheets. Got an airplane. Can't go anywhere without the camera. All who wonder are not lost. Exactly. And then um, she sent me these awesome thickers. They got a little bonged up, but that is okay. We can still embellish them up to hide the little bungs. So this is the It's All Good collection. This is one of the. This is a collection that I do like. And um, Peachy Keen, you're my home. Live simply. Yes. Yep. Yeah. You bet. Sure. Uh huh. Gotcha. I say all of those actually. It's all good. Don't look back. Rare and beautiful. Love it. And she knew that I was looking for this. Um, I believe I was able to find one of the 12 by 12 paper pads. But I don't think I ever found any of the actual paper. Like the kit. This authentic jingle is... I love vintage retro. And this here screams Christmas for me. Um, when I think of Christmas as a kid, this is what pops in my head. So, love it. And then, this... I am so sorry for the yawning, everybody. Uh, we went to bed really late last night. Um, we had nasty thunderstorms come through. My daughter's plane came in late. Then she had to go through TSA because... She brought home my son's compound bow and they lost, TSA lost the lock to it. And so they put one on and then she had to wait for them to cut the lock off. I mean, it was, it was a fiasco, but so I had to wait for that. So we got home late. That's okay. My daughter's home, which is nice. And then, so uh, back to Miss P. Uh, she sent me this uh, American Crafts. Uh, this gallery prints and so fun stuff that I can either embellish and stick in a book or like they do here is which I'll probably do will um, frame it and hang somewhere in the room so love this and these are the images that are inside life is beautiful do something nice every day make the world a better place amazing things will happen so love that Come here, Miss Karma. You want to come say hi to everybody? She's down here at my... She, she's gotten really big, y'all. She's huge and beautiful. You going to say hello? Her little motor's still going. She, ne she has never stopped purring since the moment my son brought her home that big. Come here. I wish y'all could hear her motor. It's just insane. Yeah? Say hi, everybody. <laughs> She's got her little sassy tail going. Okay. So then, um... She also sent me this authentic collection um, called Frosted. And normally I would open all these up for you guys, but there's still quite a bit to go through and we'd be here for a while. Um, but these are all the papers that are included. Um, here's cut aparts. I love this. This is wonderful right there. And then this is the sticker sheet and Miss Karma's tail. Can you see how, like, crazy, fluffy? She got a beautiful bottle brush tail compared to that little straight tail she had as a baby. She's still just a purring. Then, uh, she also sent me Solitude. And I love this. I never, um, found it. Um, but when we lived up in New York, we used to go skiing. My boys loved to snowboard and um, stuff like that and we they would sled down the hill at her house so love this and she knows how much that I love Merry Days and she sent me the Merry Days chipboard Karma's not gonna let me set it down <laughs> okay so I don't know if you can see this she loves ever since she was itty bitty she buries her nose right here on both me and my son see that <laughs> 
You're such a goofy little girl. You're not helping me. Just a purring. Lift, lift your tushy. Come on. There you go. And then she sent me this paper collection called Happy Wishes. You're such a goober. Move it. Which is super, super adorable. Single-sided. Um, this one here is a, is a um, sticker sheet. Cute cut apart. This is something that I would use for scrapbooking Christmas when my kids were younger. So, super adorable. Love this. Love that. And some more cut aparts. So, there's that. Thank you, Miss P. And she found this. I had not found this. This was during the whole uh, letterpress craze that went through Tuesday morning. But she found this Christmas. Uh, this one's called Winter Ride, I believe. And um, so happy to have that one in my collection. She also sent, and I love this. I would love to find more of this. This is the Simple Stories, uh, uh, Simple Vintage Country Christmas. And um, I'm going to try and show you from the side. Because it's, unlike other ones, they put the little thing down there. So, oh, there we go. Well, never mind. How about that? Okay. I mean, look at that. Aren't those gorgeous colors? That is just beautiful. So I think I'm going to hunt some more of this down. Because um, love it. Gorgeous colors, everything. She sent me um, a 6 by 8 of Merry Days. Can never have enough of that. She sent me another one of the um, It's All Good thickers. And this next, uh, and then she also sent the ephemera for that. So excited about that. And then this next one, it's funny because we were talking on the phone. She goes, if you're in Tuesday morning and you see a notepad with the flamingo on it, don't buy it. <laughs> she goes, you're the worst person to buy for it. Because it, it's true. When I see something, I just buy it. I don't, I don't like asking people for things. I don't like asking family for stuff. So if there's something I like, I just get it. Um, I ha wasn't always able to do that. Um, I, I am now, but this little, uh, like to do list, happy things to do. And at the very bottom, not Karma's tail, but the pretty flamingo and it's got a magnet back, which is awesome. So what are you doing? Hmm? You're just having fun up here. She sent me, and I'm not pulling this out because Karma would just chew this up. But this super adorable flamingo pom-pom that if I'm feeling brave, I can put on my luggage. I think if I did, it would go on carry-on, but um, wouldn't be able to, that would definitely um, make me stick out. Which I am fine with because everybody knows how much I love flamingos. Uh, she sent me this wonderful Ray Dunn pen. Says right, so love this. I have a horrible pen fetish. I have so many pens that I think if the zombie apocalypse happened, I would have enough writing material for a couple of lifetimes, which is totally okay with me. So love that. this adorable house mouse y'all know me and my house mouse and I actually don't have this one but look at them sleeping with a little kitty I probably have to co um, color this one like karma so oh, she's up there chewing on she approves and uh, love this 
the cozy and bright or cozy and bright stamp set I actually think somebody just gifted this to me as well so I now have two so I will probably uh, pay it forward to somebody so I just have to f I just got it so once I get everything put together this will get added to my one of them will get added to my um, gifting box and this is super exciting Hello, stand tall and dream big, flaunt your inner flamingo, be a flamingo in a flock of pigeons, you're fabulous and pink power. Absolutely adore this, this is amazing. And this one is gonna be really fun to stamp. I love the layering, so thank you, girl. She sent me uh, this cute little uh, You're the Cat's Whiskers die. I love tonic. Y'all know how much I love tonic. Are you ready to get down now? Hmm? Okay, you're not. Okay. But I love tonic. They have great stamps, great dies. So I will definitely be using that. Thank you. And then uh, a door... Uh, cozy Christmas so she gave me another one of these you cannot have enough of this particular collection um, there's so much that can be done with this I love the old red wagon and the Christmas tree the old ornaments yeah absolutely awesome some cute little um, craft bags with the flamingos and the pineapples yay a cute little ornament, a little uh, metal ornament. So I can use this to embellish or I can put it on a tree. Let me fold this item down so you can see what she sent. It is one of those, um, re you know, reusable shopping bags. But um, I adore this. Got the ladies out here in the water um, enjoying the waves. And then the other ones up here getting their sun on. Um, it's from Home Goods. And we don't, well, we do have a Home Goods here, but it's too far, so I just don't go to it. But absolutely adore this. It is awesome. It'll go in my car. And then last but not least, <sighs> she sends me this and she has this cute little um, hedgehog note on here. My sweet friend, you needed a smile ASAP. Hope this did the trick. Love you, P. But this super adorable Carland, if you look, it's flamingos and Santa hats. And look at those. Um... I haven't decided if I'm going to hang this up in my room and leave it up all year or if I'm going to save it for next Christmas. You are getting into bad stuff, girlfriend. I did some cleaning on my desk and now she's finding things that weren't here before and she wants to get into it. Yeah? It's not good for you, is it? You're going to get in trouble. But... um this is awesome it is six feet i think what i might do is i might hang it on the top of my alex uh or kalax unit that's on this side of the room it's up high enough that the cats can't mess with it and i can still enjoy it and it won't interfere with the stuff that's on the top of the, the bookcase so thank you girl i love it all um she did send me another box. No, you are not going back there. You're going to get down now. Um, but that one was kind of like a Christmas. We did a little Christmas swap. I may or may not share it, but uh, I love you, girl. You are just the bomb diggity, and you are just... I can talk to you about anything and uh, it just means the world to me to have your friendship. So 
um, I hope you guys enjoyed the friend share and um, I hope you guys are having a great weekend it is only Saturday night we got one more day to the weekend before Monday is here boo on the bright side next weekend is a three-day weekend I actually get Martin Luther King Day off so yippee I hope y'all have a great night as always love you guys to pieces happy crafting bye bye